Hello YouTube, this is Harley here with another episode of Minecraft on my RTD world and uh, I'm just sitting here messing around my house. We're working on a project I've talked about a little bit. So we're working on the downstairs. A lot of guys are helping me out. Uh, uh, thanks to these guys once again and look at this mess <laughs> So I'm working on a combination lock. I believe I mentioned it. Um, I'm not going to go in real. I cannot make this jump I'm not going to a full detail on how to do it. You can just YouTube it uh, Because that's just where I got it from because I have no idea how to do it uh, off the top of my head or anything So you can YouTube it and I'm encasing the whole thing with obsidian of course, uh, the reason be because if you have a diamond pickaxe in my world, I pretty much trust you. You're not going to grief me or anything, not unless you're like a spy or something. You really take the time just to get that grief. I mean, that's that's a lot of time to get diamonds and gain my trust and then grief me. I mean, that's a lot of work. So I figure most people get bored. Uh, but anyways, so this is the idea. Uh, if I type in my combination. Uh, this door opens it works it works very well I'm not gonna I don't want to type in my combination of course but we're trying to figure out a way to make it to where we can open the the uh, gate or open the door uh, without someone having to break it down because a uh, piston does not move obsidian apparently and I didn't realize that but it doesn't and it really stinks so uh, like I could do an iron door to go easy but somebody could use a pickaxe and break that easily with like I think an iron pickaxe will break that. So really that's, I mean, there's no point in that. It doesn't help me any. Now it's like I can figure out some kind of redstone tactics of doing it. So that's what I'm trying to figure out is a way to make, um, make I guess, someone die if they don't open the door properly. But I don't know if that's possible. So we might have to go still go on the honor system. And that kind of sucks because I spent all this time trying to figure out this, uh, this, uh, combination lock that I'm really just kind of wasting my time if uh, I try to if this doesn't work the way I would like it to so but uh, looks like uh sound six says he has an idea so he's working on that uh, thank you very much if it if it works my idea I had uh, was to make it to where if the block dropped it would activate a pressure plate and a piston and it would drop them in lava but I mean not everybody sits on on a block fully they always sit like you know on a crack or something like that so that was a very uh, difficult idea to do also so uh, that kind of stinks but this is the area I'm picking for my um, chest room area like once I get more obsidian I already used the whole stack once I get more obsidian I'm gonna like encase this whole area uh, all the redstone uh, and I would like to do the underneath portion of it and uh, above it somehow without affecting the grass I may have to replace like uh, those blocks with obsidian uh, where the torches are and stuff and then uh, then I guess over here is where the chest room is going to be I may go down lower and then I want to encase that also with obsidian um, separate from this uh, just so I have two rooms in case pretty much and uh, that's how it's going to work so nobody can get in there which I mean you can get in there if you have a diamond uh, pickaxe whatever but I mean not many people is gonna take that much time just to grief me for it and I don't know how it's gonna work I don't know if it's gonna be safe or not or if I'm gonna actually uh, if it's gonna work period I may still keep my diamonds on me I just hate I hate carrying all this stuff with me all the time on this world it's hard to really do any kind of builds I literally have to just put stuff up for grabs or somebody to take and it's uh, very inconvenient so but anyways this is the combination lock it's a uh, pretty nice and I uh, probably should light this area up a little bit because I don't want anything spawning but if you if you want to know how to do this just uh, look it up on YouTube it's uh, I found the video over it and um, I'm just gonna use it so um, thank you very much whoever made that so just look it up if you want to I uh, use make one of these on your world. It's pretty complicated and as I said, it's not really that effective because everybody can mine through blocks and It doesn't work with uh, obsidian doesn't push b Obsidian cannot be pushed by piston. So that's kind of inconvenient So we're gonna mess around with this a little bit more and maybe I can figure more stuff out. Welcome back guys So I am in a hole in a dark dark hole <laughs> uh, I messed around with that uh, combination lock and we came in with some more problems so I'm just I'll mess with it later 
I'm not for sure what's what's the deal. I have to make sure I got the redstone right. It just won't stay open or whatever. So I'll look at it later. So uh, now I want to show you what uh what my plan is for the rest of the episode. Um, and uh, let's just have a look. I don't know. I'm turning around here. Oh, it's dark. So this is my plan for the rest of the episode. It's uh it, inside of this little uh little tiny tiny block. And uh, I'm near a village spawners. <laughs> and so what I want to do is I actually want to make a farm for my fort. Like a wheat farm and just pretty much an all-purpose farm. It's going to have a little bit of everything for the fort. And, uh, I mean, if we're going to have farms, we've got to have a farmer, you know. I mean, we got to have a farmer. <laughs> so that's what I want to do. I want to get this guy over to our fort. And uh, they're going to help me here because uh, they trapped him for me. And uh, let's see if we can do this. I don't I don't know. They got all the tracks. So I can't really help because they got all the tracks. Uh, so the way we're going to do it is we got like, uh, I think like 10 tracks. And we're just going to lay them down, push them, and then lay the tracks in front. So I'm just kind of waiting on them. I don't. Oh, he's already stuck inside of there. Oh, no. Push him. <laughs> so uh, we want to get him to the fort. And then from there, we're going to actually uh, uh, put him, like, I don't know, put him in a room somewhere or something for the time being. And then we'll build, like, a little, like, I don't know, some kind of cage. What is in here? Oh, a dog. Interesting. So, yeah, that's the idea. Uh, I don't, I got I to gotta mind these tracks while they're doing it. What, what are they doing? See, like, I was going to do this a little differently and, uh. I think we might have to do it my way because this isn't working very well. <laughs> and there's a spider. This is not working good. Yeah, he's like running away. What, what are they? Come on, guys. Where's the cart? <laughs> yeah, this isn't going very good. Like, where's the cart, dude? There you go. All right. All right. Let me let, let, just y'all just. Y'all just sit back. No, he's gonna. You're in the car. Come on. Oh goodness. All right, I'm gonna have to have a little talk to these youngsters. This isn't looking very, uh, very beneficial. All right, so I got a lot of iron on me. I think I'm just gonna build some more tracks, and I'm just gonna make a track, uh, because I do have quite a bit. So let's let's see how many I can get. And I mean, I guess it's a way. Oh God. I guess it's a waste, but it's not a big deal. I can get iron. I haven't done much mining on this world anyways. So let's see. How many can we make with this? There. Now. Oh my god, they're way around here. You see, this was my plan the whole time. It's a lot easier if you just get a bunch of tracks and just lay them out. And, uh, like, I also, I was going to do a furnace cart behind him. But, I mean, it just, like, if I'm, oh my God. Like, I can make a furnace cart and do that. All right, there, that'll stop him. Now we can just uh, take all these out and keep it, keep the line going, which I hope they're doing that. I hope they're following what I'm doing. And with a pick, yeah, there we go. See this? This is how we're going to do it. Uh, but a furnace cart would probably be one of the better bets, uh, for sure. So let's see if I can make one while they're doing that. Uh, I'll need another mine cart. Mine cart, mine cart. And then uh, some cobblestone furnace. Of course. See, this is why I want to make the... <laughs> I want to make the... Chest room on this world, because... But I can't do it because somebody's going is going to take all my stuff and you know it's just it's just not fun. All right, so to do this, you just do that right there. And now he's going to be booking it. What are they doing? Oh, they're having to uh, Oh, that got off track. I'm so confused. Like, this is like just a big hole. It's been here for a long time. 
I don't know. I think a creeper blew up a couple of times. And it just made a mess. They're breaking. They're, I think they're out of tracks is the thing. Whoa. Why ain't that going up? Yeah, I believe they're out of tracks. Wow, pig, you're not really helping. Yeah, they don't have much tracks on them. Where's my furnace cart? Oh, goodness. All right, so we're going to work on this, and we'll, hopefully we can get the guy over there. That would be awesome. So I'll show you whenever we get over there. Yay! <laughs> he made it. Oh, my gosh. That was probably one of the funniest things I've ever seen happen. I think they're sending him to that barn, which I'll uh, probably end up moving him. Um, I don't know if I want him in there because people are going to be trying to kill cows, and they might hit him and stuff. Uh, so I'll probably move him somewhere else later. But for the time being, that's fine. Uh, until I get like the actual farms built outside because uh, I mean if you think of a fort like just a I don't know, just a fort in general most like farms and all that stuff they're outside uh, they're not actually inside the uh, base area so oh that looks nice I didn't realize how good that look there's my windmill that I built last episode but so yeah that's the idea um, I think we're just yeah I hope they just board him off right now uh, for the time being and then we can get like the actual farms built outside and uh that's where we'll put him i don't know where i need to flatten like a little not really flatten but i need to clear out these trees because they're loaded everywhere and just somewhere oh just somewhere near this area and stuff also i need to work on this this is not looking very good because of the lava i don't even use it on his list been a lot of time on this and i don't even use it uh so but yeah, but it's a cool design, but I'll definitely need to do more with this and stuff. So, But that's all I got for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. This is kind of a random episode and just messing around with stuff. So I'll talk to you guys later.